It's go, go, go in round nine of the UCI Cyclocross World Cup. Marie Schreiber with a furious tempo at the start. Checks around to make sure that as she goes through that right-hander, There's Betsema going through on her wheel. Another teammate of hers, Fleur Moors. There's Van Empel. Pro rider Nico Roach. Annie Roach and Stephanie Roach are in here wearing number 23 and 24. Oh, and a big fall there for Puck Peters. Peters got a big problem. Can't get her feet. The gears have gone as well. Now, Puck Peters with that crash, this could be a huge problem. And Femme Van Empel now starting to look comfortable at the front as she goes into the lead for the first time. Here comes Puck Peters, storming her way through the mud. And Van Empel, though, is riding away. Got real speed on this slightly bumpy section. That's for Ampravo, and here comes Puck Peters. Look at the speed of her. The adrenaline is pumping right now as she tries to get across. Ben Van Empel looks to be riding a pretty steady lap at the moment. Maybe she's suffering the same as she was last time. Maybe cold hands again despite the gloves. And there's Puck Peters. A little bit of a dismount onto the top, almost Frankie Dottori style as she gets off the bike that time. Two leaders. End of lap two, and the two leaders are together. And now attacking Fem Van Empel with a bit of a flourish. As she makes her way onto the sand, she wanted to have as much power into that sand pit as possible. And Van Empel almost touches the wheel. She had to come to a standstill. Shoulder to shoulder, down that drop off over the bridge. Van Empel wanted the front line. It's very important, that particular section. As we go to the hurdles again, Fem Van Empel being a little bit clever that time moved across to the right-hand side just to make life a little bit more tricky for Puck Peters to bunny hop those hurdles. Puck Peters is trying to turn the pressure on. Bit of an acceleration from Peters as she tries to put Fem Van Empel under pressure. Here's Denise Betsema into this cauldron of sound in Dublin. into the sand, uses that to good effect. Fem Van Empel really needs to keep pushing here because Peters is going to try and go all the way through the sand to the end, which she manages to do. Inga van der Heide in fourth place. And here's the attack. Fem Van Empel makes her move, pushes on. Puck Peters was found that time to not really be focused. This could give Peters enough to just be able to... Oh, and a problem there again for Fem Van Empel. Well, with such cold and wet and muddy conditions, it really will be the sweetest thing to win here in Dublin. A massive attack from Peters. And here comes the sprint. She has measured this to absolute perfection. Fem Van Empel, the World Cup leader, wins round nine in Dublin. Puck Peters in second place.